Warning tonight on recent cryptocurrency scams in our area. Yeah, a local store owner says he's seeing more people falling victim to those scams. News 3's Paul Wilcoxon has more. When you have an 88 year old lady in here crying because she just lost everything in her checking account, it's us too at the store. Cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin can be confusing to someone not familiar with the service and scammers prey on that confusion. Right now we're seeing a lot of the elderly females come in and they have no clue what Bitcoin is. They're lost. Brian Beavers is the manager at the marketplace shell in Carbondale. He says the store is seeing more people coming in using their Bitcoin machine and not realizing they're getting scammed until it's too late. We have been able to catch a few scams and stop the scam. But as Beavers tells me, they can't stop them all including one that recently saw a woman give up her life savings. But unfortunately, we had a bad one that happened a couple weeks ago. A lady lost 16400 You heard it right, $16,000 lost to a Bitcoin scammer. Unfortunately, we couldn't help her at all. The system thinks it's valid and legit, so they complete it, and it's done. The money's gone. One tactic scammers like to use is they'll try to stay on the phone with the person until the transaction is completed, playing off of fears of arrest, humiliation, or ignorance. They're very aggressive, very aggressive. But sometimes they'll threaten you for the rest, they'll threaten you with jail time, the police are coming to get you if you don't pay this money back. You know, and our elderly, they don't understand. They're right in the middle of the scam with them. So what is the best advice Beavers can give to anyone involved in a questionable deal? If you don't know how to do the process yourself, don't do it. Learn first. You have to understand what Bitcoin is before you adventure into that world. Reporting in Carbondale, Paul Wilcoxon, News 3.